Hi everybody, uh, today I am going to show you how to make side scholar game in Unreal Engine 5. You will able to make the same function like this, you can see background. Uh, you can shoot and die like that. You can also get the project, full project. Please check the link in description. So this is the project uh, I going to show you today. Uh, this is a side scholar character, it can uh, run, uh, there is a full step. Uh, I will made, made it from the scratch. Please uh, subscribe my channel for more updates like this. So open your Unreal Engine 5. I am opening. On the games, uh, I will create a blank uh, project. Uh, I am going to give the name Side Scholar Game. You can choose whatever name you prefer. Side Scholar. Uh, now project is creating so this is my project so first of all I will create some folder which may I need so side is color name yeah, all of my content uh, will be inside this uh, folder so first folder is audio then I will create uh, animations then i will create uh, uh, blueprints uh, after that i will create meshes uh, after that i will create textures uh, then materials m should be on capital letter and then i will create maps uh, I need a new level I will choose basic level uh, it's a big I will make it small yes that's perfect save everything and I will save my map I will name it uh, gameplay one I think we need more gameplay so we'll go project settings and add the gameplay here and in input there is no input we should create two input one in axis mapping one in action mapping so axis mapping move right action mapping jump uh, the button should be space bar and on uh, move right there should be a and d keyboard button you can add anything you want it should be minus one so uh, we need to create two blueprint uh, game mode I will name it side scholar the game mode or blueprint. I will create a character a side scholar. Uh, I should copy the name side scholar blueprint and I will create a I don't have a skeleton I want to create a uh, animation blueprint uh, open your uh, game mode and add the character compile and save save everything now I have few character and texture here you can see you will find the link in description you can download that so now import and import everything on the meshes i will create the folder called character now i should import the character here is uh, my character by the way i took the character from a free marketplace content i will give the link also in description you can add that too so we have three material select all and just move the material is moving it will take some time please be patient yes all material now we should import all the texture where is our textures 
here is our textures uh, select everything and drag and drop we have three normal maps so we should import it as a normal map now save everything uh, save in also take the time please be patient everything is saved now what should we import we should import the animation i have few animation this is unreal engine animation by the way i will select the skeleton and import all the animations now what should we import we should import the audio and the footstep sound select and import mm, in audio folder drag and drop ha, all now save everything this is uh, the path character i use it's uh, totally free you can uh, go and download it this man create this so first of all i will create a queue i name it run queue open it add here now i should import my other two uh, sound wave now make it little bath search random and add it add add and add save everything now open uh, the run run animation here is our character there is no texture we will add it soon now when he drop his feet we will add the sound here select our sound cue and right button add notify uh, play sound here is a foot step also run step i must say and add the sound uh, give the sound volume 1.2 save everything now we can open the jump end animation we should add a, a sound here also here is drop in add sound we have few sound and it should be 0.5 i don't know why you can change it it's up to you now in the material we should apply the texture in those material open all of that yes now go to the texture we should add uh, those four texture we have 12 texture it should be go here where is it here is it now take it here uh, delete it albedo ai AO should be below metallic normal map and AO ambient oscillation now add it metallic should be here uh, roughness should be here normal should be here and AO should be here now make it like that uh, save and apply wait a few seconds uh, it's uh, now uh, copy the down cloth down and take it here now add it albedo color should be here mm, AO should be here normal should be here and one we left what's that is that is metallic and now add it here add it uh, roughness add it here compile and save and wait 
you have to wait you know it's done now we left one material select all four place it here delete that add the albedo add uh, the normal add the metallic and add the AO uh, AO should be AO should be here uh, save and apply and wait it's done all of our material we apply all of our material now open an animation the running animation here it is our beautiful good looking texture on the character now save everything now we should create the animation blueprint what we wanted to create uh, the animation blueprint name should be side scroller animation anim blueprint and blend space 1d the skeleton is our main skeleton side is polar blend space 1d save everything now open our blend space here it is here is now horizontal axis name speed uh, maximum axis value should be 600 and grid division should be 6 you can modify whatever you prefer uh, idle here watch here and run here if you press alt and you move you can see it's running to watch and idle save everything close it uh, now open the animation blueprint here is our animation blueprint here is our output pose now we should create a state machine i name it locomotion you can name whatever you prefer or whatever you like add it here now go inside and add a state i name it idle run idle run now create another one it should be jump start uh, start now create another one it should be jump uh, loop create another one it should be jump end now add with idle run uh, from here we should add our blend space and we should create a variable that's it compile and save there is some error we will fix it very soon don't worry now on make it little organized jump start add the jump start animation uh, go to jump loop add the jump loop animation now go to jump end add the jump end now oh, on here uh, we should create a variable uh, i name it is in air our character is in air or not uh, add here uh, go here get the variable is in air and not bull if it's if it is not make it align go here now on here resource time remaining third person is start and it is less than one copy it control c and add here and time remain on the end jump and paste that if it's less than one uh, compile and save now we have to add blueprint update animation try get pawn owner is it valid 
create velocity and uh, get the vector length and add it with the speed variable add here from here and create a movement uh, component and is it uh, flying and add is in air and add here uh, compile and save now we should go to our uh, characters side is polar blueprint and now uh, we made some mistake here it should be uh, is falling uh, compile and save now go to uh, our characters select mesh add our mesh we have only one mesh location on z axis minus 90 rotation on z axis minus 90 add the animation blueprint now add our screen arm and add our camera the screen arm should be used spawn control rotation on the character it should be disable rotation here yeah. it should be 900 and it should be 75 it should be disable now delete everything and get our two input what we created in the beginning if you remember move right and jump jump on press is stop jumping on release uh, move uh, add movement input add the axis value here and the wall direction on y axis 1 uh, compile and save now add our player start it should be on zero make it upper end button it's in here now we have to add our game mode uh, everything is fine save everything and if we play f11 there it is but we are not uh, running the proper way for that we need few changes uh, select character movement search orient uh, 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 ticket now if we play we are going to that way that way and that way it's not smooth and jump is not very good we have to fix it so our side is polar character is done 90 percent now uh, make some changes uh, gravity scale should be two uh, ground friction should be three uh, z velocity should be 1000 and air control should be 0.8 we need to fill some uh, value also uh, on rotation rate uh, 720 uh, we can also change the knob movement uh, radius should be 42 and height should be that and constant plane it should be one i think everything is done at compile and save now create few like that and make it like uh, this angle now if you play it's a lot better f11 there is a footstep sound there is jump sound and there is better than previous one uh, we can go here we can go here our character is ready uh, see you next time.